friends this is going to be a cleaning session that is a little bit kind of chaotic it's just all over the place it is done over the course of two days just because of the fact that my house is just a disaster area or was a disaster area it was and was clean and then it was dirty again and then it's clean again and then it's dirty again because we are remodeling the bathroom and there's like people running through the house all the time and dirt uh, our bathroom is on the upper floor and our living room and kitchen dining room is in the middle floor and so you know it's just a bunch of mess and I have not had any time to do any cleaning done so I'm jumping right into it and it's not gonna be any concept here it's just really cleaning whatever I can We've been doing homeschooling for several weeks now, and so I've had to organize all my daughter's schoolwork, you know, just really see what she has finished and what she still has to do, and the kitchen was just a disaster area. quite on top of things but honestly at this time there's no way I do so much right now I still have a business and I have to get my work going and my daughter is still not in school because of corona so um, we're still doing all the homeschooling and she's home all day long and I have to of course cook you know I have to make her breakfast lunch dinner and she's like always there and then she has a friend over also and you know <laughs> kids make messes and then I just don't really get around to cleaning uh, her stuff and our stuff and my stuff and the kitchen and all, you know, doing our bathroom renovation, which, you know, I just need to like, coordinate and run around and order stuff and get stuff. So yeah, that was one instance here when it's just um, not quite in control anymore. making sure I'm taking my vitamins and uh, the meds I'm supposed to take right now and you know my daughter she does help and that's really cool when she does she has fun the sun is always shining right people are smiling making plans hiding behind their shades and you're doing the same it's the next day I'm all over the place with cleaning because I clean a little bit and then we eat and I clean a little bit and then I have to work and do something else and then I clean a little bit so um, yeah just this is the next day it's Sunday yesterday was Saturday and now I'm just gonna do the dishwasher unload it even when 
you know, there's a lot going on. I feel, to me, when I do actually get around to cleaning my house, although, you know, everybody tells me, well, why are you even trying, you know, even just uh, the bathroom upstairs where, of course, things are getting cut and saws, you know, s sawing going on and all that. I actually think it calms me when I have a feeling I'm trying to clean as much as possible so that we don't uh, track the dirt through the entire house. It was a beautiful day so I hung up the laundry outside. As some of you know, we don't have a dryer and I just hang it up. It's better on the clothes. It does take a little bit of time but to me that is a kind of contemplative work just like cleaning is. So it's actually kind of relaxing because I get to listen to audiobooks and nobody disturbs me because I'm saying like, well, I'm actually I'm hanging up laundry, I'm doing something. It's kind of my time. It's my 10 minutes of just being not disturbed. On my way to a weekend rumble, I forgot to check where the party was at. but the sink was so messy and dirty. You can't really see it on video so much, but it was just kind of sticky and nasty and dirty and oh, it felt so good to give it a good cleaning and afterwards, you know, just have it clean. I also went ahead and cleaned it with citric acid that was dissolved in water. And that really does make a difference. It really smooths the surface and dirt doesn't stick as much anymore. I feel it, just because it smooths out the surface, it's, it, it just repels, especially water stains. So I love my citric acid um, kind of thing that I do for my, you know, anything that has water stains, also in the shower, in the bathtub, it's amazing. It's just, you know, just water just runs off after you give that a wipe down and you don't really have to scrub it, just kind of wipe it on. It's amazing. And let me tell you, my mom, she had the worst. Um, her shower was just, it, you know, she's very busy. She has a business and all. She hadn't cleaned her shower in a long time, like really deep clean, you know? And I went in with that citric acid and did just a little bit of scrubbing. It looked like new, especially you know, like the, the 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 water faucet and all, and the silver stuff, the chrome. It was so shiny, and it looked like new. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun. Daughter, from time to time, just to take 
um, you know, from her room, take into the living room a whole set of something that she wants to play with. She had this uh, pony thing, and so she gets to keep it for a few days in the living room. So because she loves to play near me, and she doesn't want to go upstairs alone, and so I always allow her to just have, you know, just one set of something that she wants to play, either all of her dolls, all of her pony stuff, or like a lot of her Playmobil stuff. It's kind of nice to just, you know, her to play and me to be with her at the same time. So yeah, um, it does look like much, but I feel like I cleaned like all day for two days. But you know, of course, I did a lot of other things in between. Just kept cleaning, and then you know, just kept doing it. Thank you so much for watching today. I would appreciate it if you, you know, just leave me a comment and uh, let me know how are you doing, how are things in the part of the world where you're living, and uh, how are things going on right now. If you are new to my channel, please consider subscribing for videos about minimalism, family, and uh, you know, just healthy lifestyle. Have a wonderful day. I hope to see you soon.